Hey, welcome back to Wise Monkey. We'll show you how to take the door in our panel out. Panel off like uh, for um, here we'll show for a Honda Pilot, but it's about same for most of the vehicles uh, these days. So this is the door. Uh, sometimes uh, we may need to take this entire panel out if the you know door lock is not working or uh, the child safety lock is not working like especially in this case if it's unlocked but the door doesn't open anymore from inside so i have to take this off and sh and uh, fix it whatever is the problem there uh, or to replace the window now <clears throat> there is no visible screws or anything that you take off to take the panel off so most of the vehicles are made that way these days they are hidden for example in this case we'll uh, pry this off and, and then we'll find the screws underneath so tools needed usually a flathead a phillips or a square screwdriver and uh, good to have a 10 millimeter socket take the flathead and maybe uh, put a tissue around it or a cloth so that it doesn't damage the uh, uh, nice panels so like this and slowly softly try them try it out be careful not to break a lot of them are very uh, fragile so it comes out now the four screw it's better to take this connector connector out connector is uh, basically there's a little tab here press it down and pull it out there you go it comes out if you look closely there is one screw right there take that out so took the screw out now usually almost any vehicle this lever there's a little window behind it you have to pop that out with the flat head from the top actually and there's another uh, either a bolt or a, another screw there it could be a small window as well some vehicles there's a small little tap that you just pry it open and then so let's do this one took that out so there are two screws took one out already we'll take the other one out so after that the screws are out now we have to pop this open usually it slides either from left to right or right to left and right there at the back you'll see there's a clip there a little white clip just push it push it off the off that little uh, thing the uh, the metal bar it has to come off so we'll use a like that so once it's out then slide it out so now I see the mechanism is uh, that holds it right this is the lock this is the connection this is the connection to the door lock so when you move it back and forth lock should work here it's not working so that's the problem it got came off so we have to take the panel out to reconnect it now before trying to take it out just look thoroughly if there is any other spot and you'll find that right under the door handle usually there is always one big bolt under the 
uh, the door handle because there's a lot of uh, force that travels here so I have to take this one out took that one out now before you try to pull it out just make sure there is none underneath because some some manufacturers put some on under here as well anyway this one it's all up here now we'll just pry it out use the flat head push it in and ply pry the whole thing comes off out once it's all uh, loose then pull it up there you go the entire thing is separate now see these are the clips that goes on the sides you need those clips if they're broken you can replace maybe it can miss one or two but not all of them okay this is how to remove the inner panel or the door there's the speaker if you need to replace or upgrade uh, to fix the lock it's just the mechanism is right behind it it's been actually replaced in the past so right there there's the actuator right in there and the connector to the actuator, uh, power door actuator okay so don't forget to share and subscribe for more how-to videos have fun.